uh, is this actually a real credit card? Uh, this is a demo, but the product itself is very similar to the real uh, credit card. So in this particular design, we've got an e-ink display. It's a six-digit e-ink display that's embedded in the card. As you can see, it just went off to save uh, battery power. And typically in these kind of applications, the battery will last for a couple of years. And battery is probably the single largest physical component within this couple card. Two years. For two years. Two years. And in here, there's a battery. In this Inside card. the card, there's a battery. And you can see that the thickness of the card is the same as normal credit card. Exactly the same. Exactly the same. It is doesn't weigh any more. No uh, more? A little bit more. It's the same. Same? Almost the same yeah. as the normal credit card. And uh, also you can see that I can flex the card. Yeah. So if you put it in your wallet and it flexes, uh, the display will still work. Uh, because it's a sunlight readable, it's all plastic display. Yeah. It's based on e-inks electrophoretic technology. And I'm going to press that and you can see... So there was a button right here? There's you a button press. in the back that I pressed and uh, the display lights up. And you can see even in this, uh, you know, it's not a very high ambient environment. You can still read it very clearly. Now you take this outdoors, this display will look absolutely gorgeous. So, so the idea is this is a pin code. It's a PIN code. Um, you can have a one-time passcode. You can use it for different security purposes on a credit card. Now, the beauty of this is, I know we don't have a table right here for us to thump on it, but uh, I, I don't know if you can still record. I'm going to drop this card. So it drops on the floor. There's no glass to break. And then I can go like that, and it just won't break. And I'm going to turn the display on again, and you'll see that the display still works. Nice. Uh, it's all For plastic. Two years of normal use. And this is replaces this code as well, or is Correct. it replaces the pin code or both? Uh, it, it, it could replace either or. And uh, when are you shipping this? We've started shipping similar cards already. We shipped a few million units, uh, mostly in Korea. Uh, we have uh, customers in uh, uh, in Germany. We have got customers in Taiwan that ship to customers worldwide. Um, into mostly banking industry as well as security card type industry. And that's as, as secure as all this log into your net banking stuff? Yeah, net banking. It, 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 in some ways it's more secure uh, in terms of if you today if you only have like a three digit number and if somebody memorizes this number then they have that. This one, each with each transaction this number will actually change and I'll show you. Right now you've got 550614 and I'll change the number and you, you can see that the number uh, is different and it'll change per transaction. Nice. Cool. So uh, it's not hackable. You cannot open it up and plug it into a computer and crack the code. Basically it's set up that if you open it and try to uh, access the chip, the chip will uh, essentially self-destruct or sort of shut down and you can no longer access any of the information there. So you call it the e-ink credit card system? E-ink credit card system. It's, it's a smart card. Smart it's an uh, e-paper display in a smart card application.